ဒီရုပ်ပြဝီဒီယိုခွေဒီနဘရာစကာပြည်နယ်ဥမာဟာမြို့နေတွင်ဥအင်ငါရနေထိုင်ပါကကျင့်ကျန်လိုက်နာ
ตริเวโนสอสายะดีเนมะปาบาอะเทปะตုံးยะอะเฉิงอะตွင်มะเปตွင်းนั่นบากะปัญชะเนเผ็ดสะตုံးตะเนตွင်ตะยายုံโนม
စစ်ဆေးတွေ့ရှိချက်ကိုမူတိပြီးပြစီဆုံရှုံမှုနဲ့သန်ရှင်းရေးစရိတ်စကားကိုတွက်ချက်ကလုံချုံရေးစပေါ
အလုပ်ချိန်အဖြစ်တမတ်ထားသောတနိန်္လာနေ့မှာတောက်ကြာနေ့အထိတပတ်အတွင်းငါးရက်နေ့တိုင်ရှင်းနာရီဝန်ထ
ကိုဇောပါရှိအမိတ်တရက်များကိုဖုံစပ်စက်တဲ့စုပ်ယူရှင်းလင်းကြပါသည်အကေ၍ကြံခင်းမာတောင်ပါကတဲ့အိမ်
ไม่มีที่เนี่ยเด้ทาชิยามีกูตีบาตลาเนยเยยะเนี่ยดูตั๋วละเมียชิเน่งเกเมียกูกอเปียยะตาวนชิดีกูตีชิบาตลากายะน
ကလေးအိတ်ရနဲ့ပခက်များကိုဘတင်းပေါက်နာမထားပါနဲ့အစာမစားမြီအမြဲလက်ဆေးကြိုးစေပါလူတိုင်းကိုအိမ်ခန့
the court date delayed. Number six, you may be able to appeal the judge's decision once it's made. If your landlord attempts to evict you without going to court, call the police and inform them that you are involved in a dispute with the landlord and have not had a court hearing on the matter. Also call the Fair Housing Center of Nebraska and Iowa. Please note that after the initial 12 months of your contract, your lease may turn into a month-to-month -month agreement. Make sure you know what happens in your lease after the initial 12 months are up. When you decide you would like to move out, you need to give your property management company 30 days notice in writing. The 30 days usually begins at the beginning of the month. For example, if you give notice of your intention to move on May 1st, then you may move out May 31st, but if you give notice on May 5th, you are responsible for rent until June 30th. These move out policies can be very confusing, so make sure you understand the move out process in your particular lease and how much notice you need to give the property management company when you want to move out. It is a good practice to never pay your rent in cash. If you pay cash, you will have no record that you in fact turned in your rent. If you pay with a check, you will have a carbon copy and bank statement to prove the check was cashed. Certified check, cashier's check, personal check, or money order are good forms of payment for rent. If you write a check and do not have enough money in your checking account to cover it, you will be charged with a bounced check fee. When you rent a home, you are required to place a security deposit. A security deposit is a lump sum of money that the property management company holds to protect themselves from damage to the home. If there is no damage to the home when you move out, they are required to give that money back to you. In Nebraska, the security deposit cannot exceed one month's rent unless you have pets, in which case it can be more. A move out inspection will be conducted typically after you move out and it is in that inspection where they determine what damage or cleaning costs they will deduct from your security deposit. Many companies will supply you with an itemized list called a move out checklist which outlines the costs associated with leaving the unit damaged or dirty. Ask for this move out checklist if you do not receive one with your lease. It is important to note that if the damage to the home costs more to fix than the amount of the security deposit then you can be liable for the extra charges. In order to get your security deposit back when you move out, the home must basically be in the same condition as when you moved in. Things you could be charged for after you move out include any stains on the carpet that cannot be removed with a steam cleaner, holes in the walls, broken screens, broken doors, stickers on the walls, any writing on the walls, and a dirty refrigerator or stove. Normal wear, which would typically not be deducted from your security deposit include tiny nail holes from hanging pictures, the wear on the carpet from repeatedly walking on it. You may also be required to follow specific procedures when moving out to get your security deposit back. Requirements for getting your security deposit back may include allowing the property management company to show your home the last 30 days that you live there and returning the keys to the office. It is a good idea to take photographs that you can print onto paper of your home before you move in and after you move out to prove you did not damage it. When you move into a home, make sure you provide your property management company with a list of things that are broken within the first 10 days that you occupy the unit. If you fail to provide the property management company with a list of things that are wrong with the home within those 10 days, it will be assumed that you did the damage and you could be held responsible for it. Damage to report when you move in include marks on the walls, broken hinges on the cabinet, broken windows or screens, appliances that are not working properly, etc. It's important to note that you may not use your security deposit as rental payment. It is also important to note that the only people allowed to reside in the apartment are those stated on the lease. If any of the tenants change, you need to let the property management company know. If you violate this rule or any other part of the lease, you could receive a notice called a 1430-day notice. The 1430-day notice says that you have 14 days to fix the problem that is causing you to be in violation of your lease and let the property management company know you have done so or you have 30 days from receiving the letter to move out. Examples of things that could cause you to receive a 1430-day notice include trash on the premise of the building, furniture piled up in the yard, not mowing the lawn or shoveling the driveway when that is your responsibility and noise complaints from the neighbors. 
It is important to contact your property management company if your drain is clogged or anything is broken in the unit that you need them to fix. If your maintenance request is not an emergency, call the property management company during their regular business hours, usually 8 to 5 Monday through Friday. If it is an emergency, for example, if there is water in your house where it should not be, like pooling on the floor or dripping from the ceiling, this is considered an emergency. There is foul smelling sewage backing up in your unit, your heat goes out in the middle of winter, or you smell gas, these are emergencies. In emergency situations, the property management company is allowed to come into your home without notice. For non-emergency items, they are required to give you a day's notice. For example, you can be notified at 9 p.m. of entry at 8 a.m. the next morning. If you call the property management company and they send a maintenance staff to help you, please have someone there at that time to answer the door. It's important that you open the door for these people so they can fix your problem. Contact your property management company if you plan on being away from your apartment for more than seven days. If you are absent for more than a week, it is considered abandonment and your lease could be terminated. The property management company or building owner is not required under any circumstances to replace your personal property. To protect yourself from the replacement costs of your personal property, it is highly recommended that you get renter's insurance. Renter's insurance is an insurance policy where you pay a small amount of money every month and if there is a fire or a water leak and your personal property is damaged, the insurance company will pay for its replacement. Your property management company's responsibilities to you include keeping the building in a safe, habitable condition. This means they need to fix items that are broken in a reasonable time frame. They need to make sure that the property stays in good repair. The roof has to keep water out of the home. Bug infestations must be dealt with. Steps and railings need to be safe, etc. You should have hot and cold running water, heat, gas, and electric. If you are without these essential services due to the negligence or willful act of the landlord, they could be liable in a court of law. It is also important to note that your rent has to stay the same for the duration of your lease. This means that your property manager cannot raise your monthly payment during the 12 months your lease is in effect. It is against the law for the landlord to treat you differently because of your race, color, national origin, gender, religion, mental or physical disability, familial status, meaning the presence of children under the age of 18, or marital status. If you feel that your property manager or building owner is not following the law or fulfilling their responsibilities, you can contact the Fair Housing Center of Nebraska and Iowa or the City of Omaha Human Rights and Relations Department for help. Now some important notes about cleaning customs in Omaha. It is important to keep your floors clean and clear of crumbs and spices so as not to invite insects or mice into your home. It is customary to vacuum your carpets at least once a week. If you have hardwood floors or hard floors, you may want to sweep at least every other day in the kitchen and every week throughout the home. It is also customary to cover food when putting it in the refrigerator or leaving it out. Raw meat and eggs go in the refrigerator. It is a good idea to have a top on your kitchen trash can to keep bugs away and foul smells out of your living area. Trash goes in a dumpster if you live in an apartment complex or out to the curb once a week if you live in a house. Ask your property manager what day your trash is picked up. Trash should be removed from the home at least once a week or even every three days if it contains food or diapers. Purchase an all-purpose cleaner and clean the surfaces of your home on a regular basis. If food spills on the burner of your stove, wipe it up. Burners are to remain off unless they are in use. It is customary to clean your bathroom once a week. If your toilet doesn't seem to be working, it could be clogged. Use a plunger to fix it. If you are renting a house, you are probably in charge of mowing the grass and keeping the walkway shoveled when it snows. Grass is typically mowed once a week and snow needs to be removed from the sidewalk in front of your home within 48 hours of snowfall. You may not paint your rental home without written permission from the property owner. You may not get your home re-keyed in case a property management company needs to enter in the case of an emergency. You may not conduct business in your home as it is a private residence only. You may not take any of the personal property from the apartment when you move out, including the refrigerator, stove, or microwave oven.
It is a good idea to bring an interpreter to the lease signing so that you can ask questions and understand all aspects of your lease. We recommend that you have answers to the following questions before you sign the lease. Does your lease turn into a month-to-month -month agreement after the initial term is up? Who pays for the utilities, including water, gas, electric, and cable, and how do you get the utilities turned on? What have these expenses been in the past for this property? How much is the rent, and where and how do you turn it in? What is expected of you when you want to move out so you can get your security deposit back? What is the amount of the late fee for late rent? When is rent considered late, and what is the length of the grace period? What number do you call if you have a maintenance problem? Do they have a move-in, move-out checklist? If so, make sure you get it, and if not, make one up yourself. Make sure you know where the trash goes. Make sure you know if you are responsible for mowing the grass or shoveling the walkway and which parts of the sidewalk you must shovel. Make sure you know where to keep your parking pass if you have one and where to park so you do not get towed. Make sure you know where the laundry facilities are and how to use them. Thank you for watching this video on renting a home in Omaha. We hope your experience here is a pleasant one and wish you luck on your new adventure. Now please stay tuned for a special message about lead poisoning. The amount of lead it takes to poison a child is the equivalent to three grains of sugar. We care about protecting you and your family from lead. Prior to 1978, lead was a common additive in many household paints. It was banned that year because it can cause significant health problems in children and in adults. Lead can be found inside homes, but it can also be found in soil, old water pipes, toys, ceramics, and even some imported foods. Federal law requires landlords to disclose any information they know about the presence of or problems with lead-based paint on the property they are selling or leasing. This disclosure requirement must be met before a sales contract or lease is signed. This law protects buyers and renters by making them aware of everything the seller or landlord knows about lead-based paint hazards before buying or renting the property. That way, buyers and renters have more information about the property before they decide to buy or rent. However, this law does not require a seller or landlord to test for lead. So, just because a seller or landlord does not disclose lead hazards, there still might be lead hazards. When renting, you will receive a disclosure form that tells you if the landlord has knowledge of any testing for lead done on the property, and if the landlord has any knowledge of lead-based paint hazards. If the property you rent was built before 1978 and you see chipping or peeling paint, notify your landlord. You can also contact the Douglas County Health Department if your landlord does not address the situation. You may not withhold rent from your landlord at any time during the process. As a renter, there are simple steps you can take to protect your family from lead inside and outside the home. Careful cleaning around windows and doors is a simple way to keep lead dust away from children and pets. Move cribs or children's beds away from windows to keep kids safe. Make sure to wash your children's hands before they eat. Be sure that everyone removes their shoes before they come in the home. We want to ensure that children are safe. The Douglas County Health Department recommends that all children are tested for lead at ages 1 through 6. For more information on childhood lead poisoning, call the Omaha Lead Hotline at 1-877-LEAD-411 or visit the Omaha Healthy Kids Alliance website at omahahealthykids.org. Tahu muda kai di to kemasan nala, teka di bawah kedutinya atau nala tengah ohi tak dole ohi la umah ni praskani lo. Nekua tahu muda be iwi alaki bersama la nekena pembahagian des ki dole lo agi ni lo di nama pua dole ohi tak ohi tega atau nulu bata menule, ki kesa atau lomba me menule tak kuat tua ketega tohi kholah umah aku. Tama we di le ni lo. 
ta video ko ta le na ka ba na pa o ta du nga o nga lo hi ni ta kro kro pa ti se pu pa khu we lo ta de ti property owner ta tu to bo to hi ki sa ki di de ti property management kro de pula regulator kwa twa ka te ka to ta ha u ha go le hi ki sa ka sa ti na pa o le hi pa le nga o hi ni lo hi do le lo list de be i mi we da ta le ble le na pa le nga o hi do hi ki sa mi ta a lo o lo di so do ne ka se lo mi se lo ta a wo lo ta su to bo to a ka sa hi ki sa hi lo we mu da le pa re pa ka ta property management a bu le le ka kwa twa we pa le a do le o hi pa nga o hi ta lo ba ka ta ha ru ha wo le ka ba bo we ta pa ni lo pa le a re ka ta ta phu i a wo se ka ba tha phu hi le ho le ka ba kwa twa ta la a lu ta pa sa ka to pa ni ni lo o hi i kha a we ka ba hi lo na so ka ba kwa twa li la a lu si ta pa li hi do le lo list do li la a ba kha do hi ni lo ta ka to la a ga ta pa pa re pa ka ta property management ta phu i ma ta la hi ki sa a ho pa la a do nga o hi di so na pa la a re ka ta ta phu i a pa pa ta phu lo hi do le lo ta le ta be i na a lo do se lo na mi la hi ta pa i ba kha do na lo hi do le lo li ta be i mi we da ta si ki la a to pu lo mi ta a re do ma la na ka ba he hi le ba sa ba ka to ko la de na me ba se o di la na hi pu ni lo he hi le ba a se ka to ba mi we na hi le ka ba di la property management a si pu pe la to ta so ni lo a re do ma la na ka ba hi hi le ba sa ba ka to ba ba a a we i mi ta u kho ta ta kha la na ka ba hi su ba sa si la a se ka to ba di ni lo la ta ta so we lo ki property management company a ta ba ta kha ko we la grace period ta pa ba no a ni a so a se ka to di so na ta ba hi hi le se ki ti ki ta ta o lo na ba ti ki ni lo na ka ba ma lo ti ta a ga ta kha la a ko we grace period ta se ka to ta kha i me a pa ko la li do le lo list be i a pu a di so na ka si nya to la na hi hi le me se ki do ta ka pa ba no ni na ta se ka to pwe to le ni lo grace period me ta ta kha la ka to pa do so na ta o sa la ki go u a se ka to ni lo Chris Pierre ta se ni pa so ba li ne me te he ni hi le do di ba ta ko hi ka sa ko lo na ta bo ta le hi le se ki a pui do ma lo ta ko ta ho mi ba na ko pro le ne hi le se ki ho hi ka sa me te du o na le hi ba le ne hi do le lo list te be i an ni le li do hi ka sa ka ma su le na ha tho ku le hi pu lo ta re do ka te le ne ka ba ma no ni hi le mi se ki ta ko ne ka ba hi so ta bo ta le le a se ki wi ne me ba hi ta bo ta le a pui ka plo le ta po he bo ni na ta ha ha o le hi pu ta ka ka ne ka ba hi so wi ne ka ba he ke hi le lo an do ne hi la mi me ya po ye si do la a so ka te ka le we le hi la se ki go ye si do la me me ba hi po he bo ni ne ta ha o a bo le ne ka ba hi so ta po do la wi o te se bo ye si ka le ki we le ne hi le lo a ko ba yo ne ka ba hi hi le o te ta po ye si do la lo tho bo tho bo he hi le ba se ba ka to di do no ne ka ha swe ta ko ta ke de kha i lo ta hi ta se ka to gris period le li ne me te he di ne hi pu ba ta ko ta ke hi na ta pa lo ta kha le a ku we 3 day notice ne lo so so to pu liberate be i ki di si nya na le he ke ne hi le le so so to pu ne me te ma pu thoi ba ta ko ta ka no ha tho ku na le ne hi pu lo ta no ha tho ku na le ne brush ka a klu a kle o di le la so lo li bo ba si nya ba ka te he hi le 3 day notice or 30 day notice to evade ne me te he hi le le so so to pu me te me a so so si to pu ne ka ba ha tho no da ta se to so so ta pa ku da te ni kho le ne do ne li bo ba le he ke hi le le ne ka ba hi ni lo sa sa tu li ne me te he hi le ba le lu so to so hi ke sa ka to to ne mi le si nya ko a o lo hi ke sa me to to ne mi te sha ne di a so to sin me te me te a ne di te si lu so 
ตะกาดีบานิกะนี้บาลิปรเลนิกะบาเลปาพลาดนะซาเลสิญญอกัวอาลอลอตะกาดีบานิกะนี้บาลิปรเลนิกะบาเลปาพลาดนะซาเลส
list be e akha ka ba pa khu do move out checklist ni lo me ta pa ba ta kho na ka ba khu lo ta ha ha ro le pwa ba bo ki we le a ne din se u ko ta ta kha i na ka ba hi a tho si si lo di so do na ka ni ba ki ni se u ko ta ti pa se la ni hi pa ta kha i sa ka to pa na ha tho la hi pu kha hi ta o ta ka ba di so do pa na ni lo la hi pu a su ka te a tu lo na ha tho la hi pu wi a lo khi ta la pa o lo na si si ta pa mi we ya da ko zo a pa ko la ta ma ka she ka sho o ta ni ba ta du ka pa thu plo pa ka ta de ta ha ro pe tro ha ro kla lo ta ro bu ta ti la ta du lo ta khu de ba e pa ka pu ta ba e si ta pa ni lo ta ha ro la ta ta thu tho wa la na si pa ko ma ta pa a kla mi we ta pu a pu si si pu la na bla lo ta ro lo plo o ti na yo tho yo lo ya da ko zo mi lo bu kla ta na ki a we ta to o lo na ba lo di to na ka ni ba ki na se u ko ta ro na ka ba lu pu thwa hi ki sa ta ble di a pa lo we a so lo di to na ka ni ba ki na se u ko ta ta kha i kle la a ga ta bo me ta bo me we ma property management ya na hi le no o a ka te ta la a to se si ta o sa no hi ka da ki so le a we se a ru de ki kle a ga ta bo te kle la na na lo le hi pu do pa ta ho di to no na ka te ya hi ki sa le ta me na ma ha ho ba ni lo Kan ini lah lah hidup tu tu asal kita buat nak buat ha, bagi ia dah lalu nanti awak kena lalu hidup buat nak kalah lebih berwah tapi apa lah atau di situ pun hilang suap mata lah hidup sah kerja, property management asyik budi so dah kesinya tuh lalu dah awak sedap ini nanti mama, tapi awak lalu suap bani lah, nanti mama nak terblok ho dah, kita suap hidup sah untuk terblok ho. Nak ke bal lagi tak hago apa ilah kisi lo. Nanti pihak hiji sahle tak hago hago. Ke bal pahu do, pakai bal ada dulu. Video apa tak hago, petro hago. Mite mite petro atau segar hago. Tak boleh lihat tempat ada hago depan ni lo. Tanda redu kita tak kami wenis seuk kota lain hepa tak kai. Nanti orang lain hehe leh tersiwa lo. Tanda redu kita tak kai lo. Nak ke bal nak buat tu orang. Wala o la hi do nga lo ta ple yi Si te wa la ami o la Li is hi do le lo ta ple yi apu lo Wala o la hi Ata so ta le ta mi o ta kho na ka ba de si nya Wa ma ta la hi sa ka sa Property management ta blo kho lo Ni me lu si ka pa ta Hi do le lo ata ble ta kho Na ka ni ba li ta bi la a ko we 40-30 day notice ni lo Le forty thirty day no treat the bay ya come yum me way. Takota came me out all and he do lay low list the bay. Let the seal we thought of who nakamba clebago, the thing up while there. But Matala he is a cursor. Made the men a canibal little bill at all the seat of who nakaba had holler he pull on. I do in a canibal lay for him thirty day little bay is a top pet tag and we put her at all. That's what up who made a mill and he pull. Nak tetap kita kemui ba, nak putar kita potar lalu nak rebu, nak tetap nomba, mesti mesti nak tetap blok lepu ba, tak lalu nak kembar mado, nak tetap bahasa jepak kopi lalu tak tahu tak se amati tak pula, hiko hiko do, pula hiko hiko, dah nasi jepak ni lor, arah itu lalu nak seklo do, pula pula kita lalu hisa kerja, nak ciklo mika dah tahu, mesti mesti tak hago tak kagi tak kagi lalu, nak kembar bot, kita kimi u, nak kembar เจ็กเลยเนี่ยหรอปากแค่บัวนี่นะจ้าอ๋อพอแล้วก็กวาดเทเลอที่ก็สร้างข้อสารจะพากับบ้านเฮตบล็อกหรอไม่จะไม่จ้าเรื่องแล้วที่ก็อุบัติขอเอาไว้ที่กับบ้านเดือดเย็นยากกินนะจ้าเสกต่อคิดซีรีนาเรตอปุลอนไม่ก่อปายเลย Kwa kwa tre ta la hi ki sa ka sa property management la ke bo ni na ta A wa zi ki shi lo a bo a ma ta po te ka ga la ke ma se na la Ma kwa o la hi po te ka ga di to do Kwa ma ta po me he kwa kwa ta ni wa zi a tre la Ke he nu lo we la 
property management company นี่ล่ะนี่มีโอ้ละฮิในฮิปอันนี้ดิตินวินี่แกท่องได้แล้วนะปาตินฮิตเพลนี่นี่ตะกะนาโคฮิบาโคนี่ดอลเลลอลิ
ปาระวะกระตาลาฮิกิซาบะซานุลาลาฮิกะอูบานิลาคอปุลาเมปวาอาระตาอุตาสุลาอูนะตอทอตาซาตาปุยลอตะซีมานะมีหาทอลาอะ
ดีนมีปางาโอฮิตะกะเกลเลนะกะตรอปดอนฮิปูคอปูบาคาดอเซเลฮิปูมิเวเลฮิคลามิเวนิลอมากะเชเซอนะเปโตรปูมิเวเป